Hi, Mama Marcy's. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing fitness. We're going to work out our bellies to get rid of our buson or our belly fat down there. And I'm going to give you some great tips on how to avoid bloating. But before that, please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. All right, let's get right into it. All you need is a floor mat, so let's get started.
Okay, sharing with you some anti-bloating and tummy flattening tips. Here we go with number one. Be in a calorie deficit. Consuming less calories than the amount you burn can result in overall weight loss. If you love to eat like I do, you can look into volume eating, which is eating low calorie food in high volumes. Number two, incorporate protein in your meals. Some examples of these are lean meat, poultry, fish, eggs, tofu, and legumes. These types of food can help to keep your tummy full and also boosts metabolism aside from containing healthy nutrients. Number three, incorporate fiber in your meals. This helps reduce appetite and keeps your gut healthy. Number four, drink a glass of water first thing in the morning and before every meal. This helps to decrease your appetite, keeps you hydrated, and helps flush out waste. Number five, reduce stress levels. Do this by avoiding triggers of stress, like money, toxic relationships, toxic people. Have a calming routine when you are overwhelmed, because stress may lead to mindless eating. Number six, get enough sleep. Not getting enough sleep gives people a wider window to consume more calories while they're awake. Adults are recommended six to eight hours of sleep a day. Number seven, drink black coffee or green tea. These drinks not only contain less calories, they also contain healthy nutrients and caffeine, which helps boost the metabolism. Number eight, avoid salty food. Examples of these are canned meat and chips. Salt makes your body retain water and may lead to you appearing bloated or puffy. Number nine, indulge yourself in your favorite cravings. Just a bite or two is okay. Going off course for a meal is okay, it won't hurt, but make sure to get back to the grind right after. And number 10, remind yourself that results take time. Stay motivated, stay disciplined, and stick to your plan. Make it a habit. Kaya natin to mga Marcy's. Hope you had a great workout like I did, a great sweat indeed. Hope to see you guys next time for more videos. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment below. See you guys soon, Marcy's, and stay healthy.